Things are much quieter here Monday than they were Saturday at Knob Hill Park after a small wildfire burned through the area. Officials say that although these fire scars will be here for a while, damage from the fire was minimal thanks to the efforts of multiple responding agencies. Fire crews from nine agencies hit the fire quickly after it was reported Saturday afternoon, including a helicopter from the DNRC and a strike team from New Jersey that are in Montana helping with the fire season. Helena Assistant Fire Chief Mike Chambers says were it not for those additional teams and resources, the Knob Hill fire could have been much worse. We're spoiled here in, in Helena. We have a lot of resources to pull from and we have a lot of highly qualified, capable people with very good equipment. But the thing about a wildland fire versus a uh, structure fire is we can contain a structure fire to the area, the building of origin, so to speak. A wildland fire is going to follow the wind and the, and the fuel, which is much larger. In total, the fire burned around five acres. Around 20 homes were under voluntary evacuations, but everyone was back home that night. The fire is believed to have been started on the northwest side of the park by individuals with fireworks, which are illegal in city limits. Police are in contact with suspects and the investigation is ongoing. Any fire is a dangerous situation and crews saw flames shooting up several feet, but were able to knock down the fire and prevent tree torching, which could have led to spot fires hundreds to thousands of feet away from the initial blaze. A significant danger for firefighters responding to the Knob Hill fire is this propane tank, which is part of a first responder communication facility at the top of the park. Fire burned all around it and the propane tank did leak during the fire. However, thanks to efforts from firefighters, they were able to put out the blaze, save the communications facility and the expensive electronics that are in the tower. Residents in the area MTN spoke with said they are so thankful for the crews for not just their response on this fire, but all fires that have threatened homes and communities in the area. Reporting in Helena, John Riley, MTN News.